during that meeting, it was determined the blazing dog days of August are now more likely to hit us here in the valley during June or July, and the results can be daunting. According to Maricopa County Health Department records, there were 155 heat related deaths last year, the most ever and financially it's costing us more and more to run our ACs and keep cool. The cities of Tempe and Phoenix, along with researchers from ASU, are trying to turn down Mother Nature's thermostat. In a series of studies, they're seeing success with green roofs, which can lower building temps by about 40 degrees. And landscape designs that take into account one important component for overall cooler temperatures, shade. I think what we will experience here in this area is, is more heat waves, they're more frequent, they will last longer. Those are the predictions. And um, in order to keep our citizens cool, I think shade is the best option in, in, in the short term um, to provide a more comfortable environment for people to live in. Yeah, that shade can really make a big difference. Dr. Medell has been using this device she built called Marty to measure how well different types of shade work as cooling areas.